I'm Jen Phillips. Today is Monday, October 14th. Welcome to a new week. Here's everything you need to know before you go, and it only takes 60 seconds. So start that clock. A Saturday crash in West Lubbock sent one person to the hospital with serious injuries. This happened just before 630 near the Marsha Sharp in the West Loop. Police are investigating exactly how this happened. And a cheer coach is under investigation after an incident that left 13 students with burns on their hands. Parents of the students say they were made to bear crawl on a hot track as a punishment. And candidate for U.S. Senate Colin Allred made a stop in the Hub City over the weekend. He spoke to agricultural stakeholders and students about their concerns and the importance of getting out to vote, which you do in a week, by the way. Last week was the one-year anniversary of the surprise Hamas attack on Israel, and college campuses across the country saw an uptick in protests and walkouts again. But some activists are pushing unity. And it's homecoming week for Texas Tech. There are events every day this week leading up to, of course, the bonfire pep rally parade and Saturday's game against the Baylor Bears. That kicks off at three, and of course, it's a home game, so here's hoping the weather cooperates. Yeah, because we, we have some weather, which is fantastic news. It's a little cooler this week. We have rain chances. And if you need any information about all of the homecoming festivities or anything else that's happening here in the Hub City or in our neighboring areas, you know where to go. EverythingLubbock.com has everything you need. You guys, this weekend is... It's really starting. The Halloween stuff, the trunk or treats, all the fall festivals, all the things. So make your plans now. Head on over to everythinglubbock.com. Until then, I'm Jen Phillips. Enjoy your Monday.